What is up, folks? My name is Melvin. Welcome. Glad to see you here. Glad to see you doing exceptionally well. I need to stand because all that Thanksgiving food today is making me a little sleepy. So I just want to stay awake a little bit while I do this. Anyways, thank you so much for listening. Thank you so much for for watching. Um, I guess I just want to reemphasize that there, this channel is one part decompression zone, another part, let me just try to be like as myself as possible. Um, you know, not playing a character, not playing a role. I try my best to not have anything scripted. I really try, if I have an idea and it sounds good for content, do it. Speak from the heart. Make it as genuine as possible. That is what I try to do. So if you enjoy that kind of stuff, thank you. I appreciate it so, so much. Anyways, um, life as I continue on this road, uh, I am finding more ways for, for comfort. I am finding solutions to, you know, my, my stress, my anxiety. Um, something that I think is really, really healthy for, for this scenario, for this instance that I, I want to keep, um, trying to do is create my own escapism, create my world with my own rules, you know, where it doesn't matter what anything out here does, you know, in here, in this space, you can call it a safe that is space that is, that is safe, if you will, you know, a space that is safe. Um, whatever happens in here, these are the rules that I abide by, you know, these are the rules that matter. Everything out there, who the, who the fuck cares? I just need, I need time in a situation, in an area where everything out there doesn't matter. It can go home the fuck to sleep. It can bother me the next day, you know? Um, cause this day is my day. This is my day. This is my time. But the problem is, you know, and, and this happens to everyone. This happens to me, even to this day, actually today specifically, where, you know, you're just trying to enjoy your day, but you're just so preoccupied either on what you're doing yesterday, what you did yesterday or what you're about to do tomorrow. If you're me, you get bonus points because you, you do both. You do both at the exact same time. Oh, here's all the reasons you were a failure yesterday. And here are all the ways you need to redeem yourself tomorrow because you just don't care about yourself. You know, that's just my train of thought. I know it's bad. I, I am trying to fix that, but that is how I think from time to time. It's not, it's not good. Um, I definitely think um, YouTube videos have been really, really helping me out in that situation. Um, it's finally giving my ideas, my way of thinking merit. Something that I've been doing wrong with YouTube, and maybe this is why you haven't been successful on YouTube as well. Because I, I know people that, that that try to do YouTube. They try to create content, you know, um, be successful. And it doesn't always work out, you know. Sometimes you make videos and you want to give up. Sometimes you make videos and you're like, eh, it's not as good as I could have made it. Uh, sometimes you, you, you have these ideas that are so big and grand that you don't want to start it until you have all the the necessary tools and means to do so, you know, I've had all those, you know, I have, I have failed being creative and wanting to start my, my ideas and dreams in many, many different ways. I failed all in all the ways you can think of. And just what I've learned now versus the other decade of me trying is I, it, it, the way my mind is what allows me to do everything. It is my mind, my brain, whatever my brain wants to do. Evidently, that's just what it's going to do. It does like the way our life is structured is our instincts are kind of away from us. They're kind of, you set them aside. The way this world works, the way this society works, it's all brain first. It's all brain first. Everything that's instinctual first, if it's wrong, it's really, really going to hurt you. So you got to make sure that your brain sets the rules. 
and it can do whatever it wants. Whatever it wants. You might be saying, "No, and that's not that's not true." I I run by instincts, but it's like you don't do your job instinctually. You mindfully go to work. You know how to drive to work. You know how to do things. It's all mindful. <sighs> So if I'm doing this mindful, if I'm doing that mindful, if I'm doing this, 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 and this mindful, then I can make shitty content and still enjoy it. I can make shitty content and even if it doesn't make views, if even if it doesn't get any views because I made it, I'm proud of it. I'm happy that it got made. I set my own rules, my own standards. I create the world that I want to create. Overall, because thankfully, because I am healthy for the most part, you know, um, because I don't require so much to be, to just live life. Pretty much if I just have enough cash, life goes smoothly. I have very, a low bar for living, you know, my living needs are pretty much set. Everything else on top of it is just how do I, how do I sustain life emotionally? How do I make a, an emotionally successful life? And I've just been devoting more time into that. I've been investing more. Um, and it all stems back from a book I talk about so much, so many times called The Compound Effect is that even if you do something for a little period of time, as long as you continue to do it, it will turn into this creation, you know? It's like building a snowman, you know? You just got to gather the snow first. Once you have all the snow, then you can worry about shaping it into the perfect snowman. So right now I'm just grabbing every piece of snow, you know, and a winter's a long time, you know, maybe it won't take you a, a single day to make a snowman. Maybe it takes you a week, maybe even takes you a month, but you have that time. All right. You just, you got to take it step by step. You got to do each and every step you can. Okay. So maybe I don't have the perfect place to escape now. Maybe not tomorrow. Maybe not a week from now. Maybe not a month from now. But, you know, as the great Chris Chan once said, I'm working on it, you know, and that's just, that's all you can do. Um, so, yeah, that's pretty much all I had to say. Once again, this channel is for me to just let out my grievances, you know, just kind of get everything out, okay? This is all me, baby. This is how I think. This is how I roll. If you like it, great. If you don't, well, there's literally a million other channels you could be watching, all right? Anyways, thank you so much, folks, for watching. You guys take care. And the next one. And 